In the short term, however, we are obliged to respond to the urgent, unavoidable, and unanticipated effects of COVID-19. The public health sectors require costly and necessary assets. The expanded all-of-economy response will overwhelm small economies in the absence of concessional resource availability. We recognize that given the multidimensional nature of the impact of COVID-19, extraordinary financing must be directed to support small states. And we recommend three ways. First, respond immediately to the life-saving exigencies of the pandemic. Second, to develop holistic long-term recovery plans and exit strategies. And third, to build capacity to establish permanent public health structures to prepare for future international diseases, such as we've seen over the last decade, chikungunya, MERS, SARS, and Zika. 